Oh, it seems to me that people should be allowed to dine out. Uh, if, if you get protesters on the street, it seems to me you should be able to dine out. And that's what our, our guest says. New York State Assemblyman Mike LePetri is with us. He's a Republican. Mike, you just want, this, you're talking about New York City right now. You're saying that, look, if you've got these the mayhem on the streets, people should be allowed to open up their businesses again. Is that what you're saying? Well, throughout all of New York State, frankly, if thousands okay. can cause mayhem in our streets, then our special needs children can get the services they deserve. Families can go out to restaurants and enjoy food with their children. You could have those who are trying to develop a living to be able to put food on their tables. And it just doesn't make sense that we could allow certain viewpoint discrimination to occur where we could have thousands just gather out without... Uh, masks or social distancing to do what they want and loot and destroy our businesses, yet our businesses cannot be open to provide for their communities? Yeah. I don't get that. What, what do you make of what's going on in New York City for the last five or six days? I mean, where is, where's the National Guard? Uh, aren't they, I mean, it, you know, they're not protecting... The, the police can't do the job. They're overwhelmed. Where's the Guard? Where is somebody protecting businesses here? It's absolutely disheartening to see. I mean, you saw what, what happened in Minnesota was a disgrace. And what they had the opportunity here to do is you could do peaceful protests. But when it leads to devastation and chaos, then that's an all-out difference, where our police should be, be given the authority to do their job, to quell these riots, to prevent these looters and arsonists from destroying our communities, and instead allow those who wish to protest can do so peacefully, but at the same time allow our law-abiding Americans who are now locked up at home because of our governor's orders to say, no, we can't go out into the communities, you can't go out into work, allow them to also live their lives too then. Have you, you, no, have worries, both... have you no worries about spreading the virus or a second wave? Well, apparently there are people that don't care about spreading the virus or a second wave. A quarantine is effectively over, as I see it, because if you're going to have all these people gather out there and not care, you can't have one day where you're saying, oh, we have to be concerned about the virus, and the next day completely ignore it. It's either all or nothing. And frankly, at this point in time, people have had it where we flatten the curve, hospitals can now manage capacity, let's go out, live their lives, because people are suffering. They can't right. provide food on their tables, they can't operate their businesses, and that's wrong. And you know, specifically over with what I'm doing, that's why I'm running for Congress, because you have to restore common sense in New York State. Because right. allowing people to desecrate our churches rather than having them open up for prayer doesn't make okay. sense to me. I gotta go. Mike LePetri, New York State Assemblyman. Thanks for joining us, Mike. We appreciate you being here, always. Thank you. Thank you.